Hi. Um, just move the mic up a bit. <laughs> so. Hi. Um, this is another test. Um, this uh, this is um, testing um, the 360 live stitching experiment. Okay. Um, it's 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 not quite a product yet. Um, I'm hoping it won't be long. Um, you never know. Uh, but we'll see about that. So, um, uh, but I thought I'd do one of these videos. I, I could be streaming this, which I'm not. Um, uh, first, let me explain the, um, the 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 camera quality. Um, so, there's a couple of issues with this. Well, firstly, as always, if I don't think this is good enough, I'm not going to put it up there. Uh, so, obviously, if you're seeing this, it wasn't too bad. Um, but this is experimentation time. And um, so what I'm doing is uh, the I'm using the two Git2 cameras. They're running via USB mode. The last video I showed you was Wi-Fi, so you didn't have to be connected to the computer. But this is a basically if you run it by Wi-Fi, you get a 1280 by 960 streams, which um, is good and it's fast and actually works very well. Uh, and even even works on mobile. If you saw, hopefully saw the the video app. But this is to show you slightly higher quality. So um, this is be ideal. Now, I will say this first of all. I'm at IO bound, okay? Um, that's not like I need to eat some prunes or something like that. Um, but basically, um, my my USB data is not, my, my machine's not quick enough. I mean, that's the reality of the thing. And I need to build a new one. And I don't know if it's the... Um, the USB, because these are USB 2 cameras, although I'm going for a USB 3 hub, which is going into a USB 3 port. Um, uh, and I don't know if it's that or if it's the data getting onto the bus, because I've got a PCI 2 bus, not a PCI 3 bus. I think it's a mixture of a whole load. Plus, I've got it's an old G CPU and GPU. Um, so it's a GTX 780, and it's an FX uh, 3850. Is that what it's called? <laughs> I don't know, but... It's a good AMD chip, but it's not as quick. So I'm going to build a faster machine because I think at the end of the day, this stuff needs high-end hardware. Um, but anyway, that explains why the the video is looking... Well, it's actually running probably about... I timed it. It was running about 13, 14 frames per second um, to actually get to it. So, uh, oh, yeah, it's good news about cameras. Um, so, um, yes, sorry, I throw my track a bit. Um, yeah, so uh, it's running at, uh, at 1920 by 1440 at the moment, but it's at about 13, 14 frames a second. Now the cameras, if I put it, if I put it into a feed, the cameras give out, I think it's 30 frames a second, so they're fine. It's nothing to do with the cameras. It's just purely to do with my box here. Um, whilst it's a bit of a beast, um, it is having. I think it's just struggling getting the data. The CPU was banging, and you know, so um, I'm pretty sure it's just getting data to the GPU. Once it's on the GPU, all this stuff's easy. It just you know, it's nice and simple. Anyway, so as I said, this experimentation. Um, that's it, really. That, that, it's just to show you it working and to see what you think of the quality. I mean, um, I, I this is a kind of... I, now, I could be streaming this. Um, now, uh, I, as I said, I'm going to build another machine. Um, I've, I've also got... Um, now, I really like the, the Git 2 cameras. I really do. Um, and, and because they're half the price of these. However... Uh, this is the uh, new Yi 4K. Um, oh, uh, no, I was going to say about audio being out of sync, but I may correct this in post. So if, if the audio is out of sync, you know I haven't, I've haven't. i been too lazy to correct it in post. Right, so um, this is the uh, Yi 2, or the Yi 4K, um, which, is a, which is a really nice camera. Actually. It's a nice sturdy little camera. They, they kindly sent it to me. I've got a, a, a duet rig being printed at the moment for it specifically so what you're going to see on here is kind of possible um the issue at the moment is they've got to sort out the uh the wi-fi because it needs to go station mode so this will log into a router or a camera or, or router um I, I, and this will all be this will all be wi-fi but they do say they have a 1920 by 1440 wi-fi stream so if that's the case this will be actually a very nice camera for this rig setup. It will add about two hundred pound. Just, just, just to discuss, basically, the camera you're that's filming this now uh, is four hundred pounds. Now I'm gonna, 
because I want to charge a hundred pound for the software. That's everything. That's the real time stitch. That's the um, uh, the the streaming. In fact, the stream. It's not really streaming itself. It's relying on a third party app. And that's what I'm doing. I'm actually using. I use a product called XSplit Broadcaster, um, which records anything on the screen. So um, that's how I'm doing it at the moment. Uh, th this will change over time, as with everything. Um, so at the moment, I'm relying on a third party app to do the streaming and, and in fact, the recording as well. I use the same tool. Um, there's others out there, and there's the free ones out there, but I actually really like this one, and it, and it costs a little bit, but it's it, it's worth the money because I do this all the time. Anyway, um, so again, back to the camera. So uh, about five hundred pounds for the camera with the software. That's using the Git twos. This thing uh, with this one, it's probably going to add two hundred and fifty pound on top of the price. Um, I mean, you, I leave it to you to decide which one you got. I mean, at the end of the day, and this won't work with USB because well it doesn't support webcam basically so um, this isn't going to work um, but the um, it would do I it should it should in theory do this quality over Wi-Fi assuming it you know it works in the end I can get it to connect and that's it really uh, I just I, I just want you to have a look at stuff and see I'm just gonna yeah, <laughs> guess what arrived yeah I told you about this yeah, it right. It doesn't work. <laughs> I'm sure it's just a, a setting or something like that. But um, I've actually picked it up for something to see if, if you can read it. I don't think you can. Uh, maybe if I push it really close. Um, yeah, I, I'd like to use it. I just haven't really got time for it. And to be honest, it's too low resolution. Um, and it's more expensive. <laughs> there you go. Um, so uh, that's it. Um, as I said, this might not appear, but um, there you go. I hope you like that and um, talk to you soon.